Stay a while and listen. Hello, welcome to the Freak Show. Bumpy Mix Squiggums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as I start up my coverage of Falnarian Tactics 2. That's the follow up to Falnarian Tactics, not 2, the, the, the original. Anyhow, um, basically, the last of the videos should be going up right before this one goes live, and we're going to hop in and just start basically where we left off. I think I'm going to continue with the keyboard and mouse. It's, it's okay, it works. It works. Uh, it's mostly the mouse, but it's fine. And yes, there's going to be this, and there is going to be another game coming really soon that's still in kind of the same world as Falnarian Tactics. It's non-canon, but it's in the same universe with some... You, you'll see. You'll see. Anyhow, it's going to be... I guess, hopefully this comes out, like, late Christmas, maybe maybe Christmas, uh, post-Christmas Day, Boxing Day, I guess a lot of people call that. Anyhow, it is what it is. Let's hop in and let's begin our new adventure, our new journey. Uh, select the difficulty of the game. Hell or Nerfello. Play the game as it was meant to be played. I am all about that. Let's do this thing. Sukino. Team Sukino is, of course, the developer. All right, so there are the, the, the thing in the Majigurubu Bruce. Those are the, uh, the controls, and I'm totally going to remember all of those things. That's fine. Welcome to Valnarian Tactics 2. In this tutorial, we will briefly go over the basics of gameplay. Here are the important things we will be going over. How to play, extras, shops, information, side quests, and etc. First off, if you're using a mouse, it is left click to confirm, right click to cancel. The mouse and the keyboard are two separate control types. The keyboard is Z to confirm and X to cancel. And of course the Xbox One slash 360 controller is A to confirm with B as it's cancel. Please use which playstyle suits you more comfortably, and don't shut away from experimenting. Sure, cool. Much like the first Felnarian Tactics, Felnarian Tactics 2 contains a story that spans several chapters. All you have to do is press the next button from the base camp menu to proceed to the mission story quest. You also have an access to a wide assortment of side quests. These are optional, but severely important for leveling, gearing, and supporting your units. You can also obtain rare loot and new units from some of these missions on top of gold and bonus points. Using bonus points and gold you have acquired, you can use the shop command to gain access to a wide variety of shops that sell various weapons. It is very important to note that all weapons have durability and will break if used enough on a successful hit. The more the weapon costs, the less durability it has, the stronger the weapon is. Kind of, you know, it's not even, a, it's just like a, a barely an edge of a sword, right? It's not a double-edged sword. It's like, hey, this is really strong, but this, it's, hey, it's really strong, really expensive, and it's only going to last like two shots. So it's like, it's like a triple-edged sword, which doesn't even make sense. It's, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, and, and two of the, the edges are dull and or possibly like negative edges, which also doesn't... Anyway, we're moving right along. Knowing this, don't count weak weapons out as a character with good stats and skills can turn even a broadsword into an unstoppable killing machine. I believe I exemplified that exact thing for most of my playthrough of the first game. Anytime during the title screen and the base camp menu, you may look at the extras such as character bios, the music room, and the gallery. Most of these things are unlocked at the start, but some require you to progress through the story in order to unlock them. Speaking of progressing through the story, you will meet and acquire new and useful units the more you do the story. Main characters can only be acquired through the story in normal mode. However, there is another important thing to note. It is the information button on the camp menu. Pressing this will teach you all about the importance of several things. You can also have limited time dialogue with certain characters. After you acquire a new character, it is best to check back to the information tab often. Now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the most important part, the gameplay. Before a battle begins, you will be in what is known as the battle preparation screen. During this phase of the game, you may gear up, swap out, and place your units on the battlefield using the manage and unit commands. You can also view your objectives, press the cancel button to take a scope around the field, and view the various commands. When you are ready, simply press the spacebar or the start button on your controller, 
because controllers have space bar. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Uh, to leave battle preparation screen and start the chapter. You also have the option of clicking fight. See? It's full circle, right? You got the controller, start button, you got the keyboard with the space bar, and you still have the option for your mouse. You thought you thought that maybe you had to hit the space bar with the... I'm sorry, guys and girls. I'm just having fun. I'm glad to be back playing this again. It's been over a month. Almost two months, I think, since I, last, since I finished Falnerian Tactics 1. So, uh, yeah, this is my Christmas Eve right here. So, nah, uh, sorry, my Christmas night right here. Because Christmas Eve was, yes, it's fine. During battle, select a unit and move them on the blue squares. This is your movement range. The red squares you see outside the blue ones are your attack range. Different weapons have different ranges, usually described in the weapon itself as are by 1-1 one, one, or 2-3 by default. Bows cannot attack anything directly in front of. It must be at least one square away from their target. Mostly every other weapon must be directly in front of their target. But all weapons are different and have different range as such. Utilize the different weapon types, ranges, and attributes to turn the tide in your favor. Lastly, here are the unit types in color-coded fashion. White, a unit that is in your group and is selectable. Gray, a unit that is in your group and is not selectable. Yellow, a unit required by the mission. Blue, a unit that is restricted from the mission. Or for the mission? For, for the mission. Knowing everything in this tutorial, you are now ready to experience Falnerian Tactics 2. Alright, I'm down with it. Let's get this thing going. Let's see what's up. That's a very white screen. Remember, black trans... What is happening? I'm disturbed. And I love everything I'm seeing at the same time. What? The heck was that? Oh god. After the Shalmanai's success in eradicating the Garfarian Empire, peace was instilled. At long last, many celebrated their victory across the land and were hailed as heroes. Drestabil rebuilt itself and Raiden took the reins. The kingdom of Kasania dedicated the shrine to the fallen heroes of the past, especially a big one in honor of Momo. All seemed well for a while until Endelda rose to power and sought revenge for killing of their king Alexander and all of their legendary knights. The new leader of Anelda did not share the same goal as everyone else. It would make it his ambition to wipe out the remaining Shelvanai and anyone who stands in his way. The switch to influence holds an higher grip over the world and some cults have even been erected in his honor. His name is Val Valtrainus, I'm sure, and he is out for vengeance. So in this, a small ragtag group of ventures set out on a quest to stop him and restore Anelda to an enlightened sense of power. Will they succeed or has the darkness spread too vast? Only time will tell. Remember one thing, if any. Peer beneath the wind felt dreams. Please slow that down. <laughs> Please slow that down. Oh my god. Uh, or let it scroll. I don't know if there was... I don't know how much that was. If there if there was enough space, like let it scroll and then like stay on the screen and then like be done with... I, I don't know. Don't Just don't like make it auto scroll. Normal mode or survival? What does that mean? Uh, uh, I, I don't... Normal? What what is survival mode? I don't I don't know what that is. Prologue, brand new day. Lithra Path. Explain to me why we are here again. Ooh, this is nice. To obtain the materials from these monsters. Once we gather them, we can use them to make powerful items and weapons to help you guys on your missions. Also, I get to make my special soup that you'll be dying for seconds of. Okay, so that's Samantha and who was this person? Faye. Sam was the, uh, the spear-wielding last that we got early on in the game, if I recall correctly. But there are so many of them. You worry too much, Faye. We'll be fine. I trust in our abilities. Besides, we need to not let the others down. Especially Ryu. Who, or Ryu, or Ru, as some people, I don't know. Uh, Ryu, Ryu. Hmm. How do I want to go about it? Whatever I say, that's, that's whatever comes out, that's what this is going to be. Especially Ryu, who probably has it worse than any of us, and that's Koharu. Yeah, Ryu is on a solo mission, isn't he? That's right, but I'm sure he will be fine. He is a ninja, after all. Getting in and out of places of detected is his specialty. So I'm sure that he will be just fine. Uh, that comforts me, Bryn. Thank you. Wait, what about Tolum and uh, Shenama, Sh oh, sorry, Shinami? You talk too much, girl. Put your weapon up. Here they come. R right Sorry. Let's do this! Uh, oh, see, it looks so nice. It looks so nice. 
So this is an updated engine, if I recall correctly. Um, from what I've heard and read. They're so tiny! And these are little blobbies! Sorry, I like this. Uh, what kind of units we got? We got Faye, Brynn, and Koharu, and then Samantha is the spear-wielding lass. Uh, I'm gonna right-click here. Manage. Do I want to manage? Is there any reason to manage? Nope. We just, okay, let's... Fight! Uh, sorry. Fight! Start the chapter? You bet we're just starting it. Route the enemy. Defeat condition? All units out of action. Yeah! Okay, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm really into this. Um... So right click? Yeah, see, that's the enemy movement range there. All right, cool. By the way, if you are fans of this, and I know it's not really someone... Like, there's another game that I'll be covering the same day. I, Tales of Bisteria, I think it's what it's called. And essentially, like I said, that's one that's set in the Falnarian Tactics world, kind of using characters and locations and stuff. But it's not canon. It's kind of like a, a side story, an extra tale, if you will. Uh, there's another game that's going to come out looking almost exactly like this, and I cannot remember the name of it right now because I'm drawing a blank. Uh, it's like Vesteria or something along those lines. Chapter 1. Essentially, the person who created Fire Emblem way back in the day, the original Fire Emblem up through like the first six or seven titles, I think it was that far in, he uh, was ousted and they decided to go in a different direction. And there was... Anyway... I'm not going to go into the history of Fire Emblem. I watched some fascinating stuff about it, but long story short, he created two other games that were very much Fire Emblem. They were basically exactly the same. Um, called the Tear Ring Saga, and then, oh gosh, the Berwick Saga? Saga Berwick? Tear Ring Berwick? Sa I don't know. Uh, anyway, there's a new game that he's releasing, essentially, and I think it's the first one that's releasing to PC, and it's coming out on the 27th of this month. So if you guys like what you see here, you enjoy tactics or strategy games, uh, definitely check out these, Foundering Tactics 1 and 2, Tales of Bisteria, and then check out this other one that I'm doing, because it's going to be fantastic. I can't wait to see it, I can't wait to play it, it's like I can't wait to get into these. Alright, I'm going to stop talking, we're going to get back into playing. I apologize guys and gals, there's a whole bunch of stuff going on, I'm a bit stressed out. It, like I said, it is the not only the holiday season, but it is also, um, I'll be going back to work, I've had a few days off, and I'm a little bit... A little bit bummed out that I have to go back to work starting tomorrow, essentially. Um, so, that's always kind of meh. Oh, I get to control you. Cool. I do not get to control you. It always makes me think. And then you bring me back to reality. Oh. That was weird. Um, okay, so we're going to end. I like. I, I really like the presentation. It looks nice. It's, it's a step up. Wow, they look weird when they go gray. They seem to move a bit quicker than they did before, too. Let's just get these ingredients so I can cook one heck of a meal. You tell them, Sam. Alright, so... I guess there... Sniper! Oh, that did not... Oh. And you're a sword maiden? You don't really look like a sword maiden. Like, not that I know what a sword maiden looks like, mind you, but... Nope. But if I were to know what a sword maiden looks like, I don't think you would be it. Are we strong enough to one-shot this thing? What just happened? I'm sorry? Well, I guess I'm going to attack you with a, with a daguerre. Get attacked by the daguerre. I didn't check to see, like, my chance to hit or any of that, so that was... Disappointing. Um, I'm assuming I hit you with this. And uh, two minutes of power, holy, one, one to four damage. Well, I could have been so much further away than I was. Well, that's disappointing too. All right. Well, whatever. Let's see what happens. Probably bad juju magumbo. Well, Bryn's super mad that she got hit. Okay. What do you got for me, Koharu? That's right. Ah, that's still one thing that I would like to have seen slightly different. It's fine. It's not that big of a deal, but it's still something I would like to have seen. I'll explain it here in a sec. I know there's only so many assets and things that are a bit. Oh, they're little archer people. Nice. I mean, not not really. That kind of kind of hurts, but also, oh. 
Okay, don't, no, don't hit me. Yikes. Are we gonna die? Did I already overextend? Thank goodness he's dodgy. Lay down your weapon, or lay down your life. <laughs> you say as you just chuck a spear right into her face. Okay, you know, that's fine. Uh, how, what kind of range do I have? Oh, let's, uh, let's take a little bit of a look at you here. Got a wooden bow, range of two, a ring of speed, that's cool, I guess. We definitely got our booties whooped a little bit. A little bit of booty whoopage. Sniper dazed. What does that mean? It means that you just got shot back for no reason. I mean, not. That's not what it means, but that's what happened. Alright, I think I'm going to use my... I don't have one. I am going to trade with you. And I'm going to get the cure leaf. No, no, don't. No, not the ring of power. Uh, it's my own fault. Uh, we're gonna use that cure leaf. Yeah, use it. Uh, it's delicious. Cool. And you're done. All right. Cool. And now you, being the the white magician that you are, keep, uh, I mean, I guess that seems kind of like a waste, though, doesn't it? Hate it. All right, whatever. We're gonna move here. We're just gonna attack the little one. Hopefully, we don't get got. We got it Ooh, a level up. I'll take it. Oh, I forgot to read what the, the skill level up was. Sorry, I've been I've been so I've been skipping so many things lately that I'm just it's like second nature to skip stuff and. I don't like that. I don't want to have that happen, so we're going to try not to let that happen in the future. Oh, God. What are you going to do to me? Dodge it, Bryn. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, girl. Yeah, girl. Level up. Ooh, some nice level up stuff. Look at that. Skill, defense, speed, strength, and 2 to HP. Nice. Yeah, girl. Oh, okay, Sam. Catch. Oh, you don't, don't mess with Sam. She come back with a vengeance and she <gasps> I've served my purpose. What? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Uncool. What why are you glowing? So um Ah, I finally found you guys, but uh you seem to need my help. Don't worry, I'm coming. Uh Syndra, you you probably should have been here last turn before our dude got crit and killed. What time you got here, Syndra? I was a bit worried. Well, you see what happened. What, enough chatter. The enemy is focused, so we should too. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. So... Bad Juju went down. Seriously? Oh, this is not going to go well. Oh, you're gonna die too. Son of a... <sighs> Alright, um... Well, if you guys are looking for, like, the, the smartest, most powerful, best player ever... <laughs> it's not me. Well, maybe Bryn carries the day. I don't know. I don't know what's going on right now. It's, it's not great. You're kind of getting booty whooped. And it's an unpleasant thing, to be sure. Even Samantha's struggling a bit here. Oh, Samantha's not gonna make it, probably. I can't miss this chance. Your claws will be mine. Yeah, they're gonna be in you, and you're gonna be dead. Don't fail you. Well, you're already gone. Oh, please don't die. It, mm -hmm. Don't suppose you're gonna die. Nope, just right on the face. Cool. So, this has gone horribly wrong. I think I could have moved her last time, and I totally didn't. Uh, yep, so that's not great. At least I stole the cure leaf. Might keep us going. She was probably full health, wasn't she? I don't know. I didn't even bother looking. 
I'm I'm a, I'm a little bit panicked right now. I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little bit scared. Uh, it, things are a little bit spooky right now. The harpy won't do tremendous damage to me, but you know, enough damage to make me really really sad and terrified. All right. Um. You know what? Hmm. The harpy's almost dead. Um. Basic spear. Let's just, let's just do this. Boop! Dead. Alright, cool. Next up. Gotta kill the harpy, because if I don't, I'm probably not gonna make it. Your claws are mine. Now, usually they give us a little bit of leeway, the developer does. Uh, the early missions, because they're like, hey, you're gonna be really terrible, make bad choices. Here, nobody can die the first few levels. Let's see if that's actually true. Because if it's not, we're going to have a real bad time. Like, if you want to keep attacking the, the horsebound last, by all means, Syndra will end you. Easy sauce. Mission complete. Alright, we got some bonus. And we got some gold. We got what we needed. Let's go back. Right. Yeah, none of us died at all. I just hope the others return safely, like you guys did, too. Look at that. No data, guys. Let's start filling this bad boy up. Actually, let's not do it there. Let's do it down here. Number five is our our mid-episode uh, mid save. All right. The Prologue Rescue. Oinklin Raider Camp. All right. Ooh. Who the pig peeps. Oh, who dis... Oh, it's our ninja boy. Well, let's just, let's just hop in. Start the chapter. Let's do it. Looks like the intel on the mission was right. Let's see. There's about eight pigs. The prisoner seems to be contained there. I'm willing to bet the key is in there. Here? I can sneak in, grab the prisoner, and head over to those mountains. Or I can silently pick them off one by one. I guess I'll just go with what feels right. Anyway, let's do this. Yeah, no, we're just going to go in and kill everybody all at once. We're going to be like, oh, if, uh, Zachary. Okay, if um, Ryu, Ryu, Ru, or Zachary dies, uh, bad Juju Magumbo happens. Okay, so there's a thing here. It says pick them off one by one silently. I feel like that's not really a thing that we can do, but we'll try it. We'll see. Are they going to move at all? Nope. They're not. They're, they're just going to sit there, right? Be on your guards. God's God. Something smells fishy around there. Oh, I see you, ninja. Oh, wait, wait, what? Somebody help me. Shut your mouth and stay quiet, prisoner. Got to do something fast. They seem at their patience, patience, patience limit. Sure. All right, he's coming over here. He's angry. Somehow he magically saw us from like a million miles away. So that's a thing going on. It is a weird soundtrack. It's kind of funky. Pick him off one by one. What is a slicer? All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. What, what are we working with here? A one to three attack and a one to two attack? What the, what the I think I'm going to go with the sickle on uh, this guy right here. We're going to do 22 damage. We said good day, sir. You can't escape. Yeah, see, so what happened was you got got. And that's really all there is to it. Where do you think you're going? I am going to kill you. But I'm going to do it quietly, because you sound... Wait, what? How does he have, How does he have hit points left after that? It's like my first one did 11, and my second one did, like, none. Well, that's not good. Do I want to take this guy out? I'm... <sighs> I mean, 
percent chance to hit. You aren't getting past me. Okay, and the third shot. It's a charm. Wouldn't you know I'd miss one? All right, he does have the ability to heal himself if need be. I think I might even utilize that right now. Use that cure leaf. That's right. Like the ninja that you are. Very cool. Sorry, I'm just trying to move the camera and it's... I got it. End. Oh, the key's up there. That's right. I remember now. Where do you think you're going? We, we've been over this. We keep throwing it out. Keep slinging it out like Peter Parker, man. Wanda, HP, skill, defense, strength, speed, magic, and luck. Pretty, he's kind of a big deal. Just saying. Hey, where'd Hampton go? On a raw air? He may well have been. Aha! We hit our first attack, and our second attack. What? It's like a miracle, ladies and gentlemen. It is like the miracle of mercy. Except we're gonna show none. We're gonna show no mercy. Chest. Oh, I got a key. They didn't think to lock the chest, yet they put a key in the chest? A little confusing. That's got a little, little sword on there. I might need to go visit that and see what's up. Do you like to be my friend? Good. Excellent. Here, catch. Hold this. I am asking for it. Thank you. End. Alright, what are we doing now? Yep. Move on down here. Traveling merchant. Shh, be silent. They are looking for us. Quickly. We must hurry this transaction. Ooh, what's a ser serific serific ser ser serific? No, no, that's not. Uh, what is this? A feather that allows the target to be revived. Oh, it's like a heaven wing. Okay, ring of speed. It's another cure leaf. I'm gonna grab one of these. Yes. Um, I'm gonna grab a cure leaf as well. Maybe I, you know what? Why not? We'll get a ring of speed too. Why not? We'll just do we'll we'll just do everything. It's fine. Um, there's really only two bad guys left, and I, I'm feeling pretty good with myself being the ninja that I am. Is there anything to do here? There is a village. Look at that. These pigs don't know when to quit. I think they might die today. So, you can have all I have. Don't thank me, and don't give it back. I've made pace with everything. Thank you, Matthias. 50 gold. Did not really cover my expenses, but you know what? I appreciate it. The gesture is appreciated. Oh, I can, ooh, I can do more village things. Be safe out there, dear. Please, take this. Cure leaf. I have so many things. Trade for this, I mean, no. Uh, this one? Sure. Nope. Uh-huh. I'll pretend like I didn't see you if you leave right now. Oh, well, that was convenient. Thank you, Mr. Lazy Pig. Is that piggy gonna see me? Nope. I'm gonna be able to sneak up on him and, and stab it, stab, stab him. By stab it, stab, stab, I mean chuck sickles at him from afar. One and a two. He did. Yeah, that's right. You level up, right? Oh, I skipped it again. I'm sorry, guys. Yeah, it's fine. All right. Oops. Let's move you on up this way. We'll wait it out. End of the turn. The ally phase is quite underwhelming. The door is there. Uh oh. I'm gonna click on the door. I'm here to get you out. I'm here to get you out. Come with me. Oh, thank the gods. Stay quiet. When you get out of here, stick close. Yes, sir. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, what? He... It's 
So we gotta get to the mountains, I say. Oh, I see. There's a little little cavey there. A little, a little cavey cave. Alright, cool. And... Waddle on down to Chinatown, buddy. Let's go. Ending our turn once more. And I think it's time to say good day to our final pig friend. Now you're asking for it. I am. I am always asking for it. Cool. He's dead. Victory is kind of ours-ish, I guess. They've got to both get over here. I don't I don't know what's happening. Maybe I got to just get here. Wait. Maybe he's got to get closer. I'm going to move out of the way. Maybe, maybe he gets there and then everything's good. I did it! I'm a hero! Let's go back to talking about what a hero I am. Mission complete. Cool. That one's so much better than the last mission where I got everybody killed. Thank you for saving me. I'm glad you got Sylvanas' request. Sadly, those onklings. My god, what did they do to you? They tortured me and they... They... They killed Sylvanas, my best friend. D that's spelled wrong. I am... Pretty sure, yes. Technically, it's digwesting pigs. It should be disgusting pigs. D it's fine. Uh, I'm sorry for your loss. Take solace in the fact that they can't hurt you anymore. Yeah, I suppose. There is a caravan of Aneldian soldiers waiting on the other side of the mountain. Follow me and we'll bring you to safety. I can never truly repay you. Also, does truly have the E or not? I can't remember. Save your breath. We can talk later. That's right. He's got to have that edge to his voice. Anyway, guys, gals, ladies, and gentlemen, that is... What is that weird symbol? Anyway, that is going to do it for this particular episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. It is our... Kind of our inaugural, our, our first steps into the world of Felnarian Tactics 2. Hope you guys enjoyed the playthrough of Felnarian Tactics 1. They are on... Well, they look very similar, and there's a lot of assets that are still used. They are on two different engines, so a lot of the issues and problems that plagued the first game should not be here in the second game. So I'm really looking forward to seeing less problems and just the continuation of a good story. So hopefully you guys are on board and you're excited for it. If you guys want more information about the game, where to get the game, information on the developer, any of that wonderful fun stuff, it'll all be down below in the description of the video and various links and things of that nature. If you guys enjoyed, stick around the channel. There'll be plenty more SRPGs or tactical strategy, role-playing game, whatever. Whatever these things are called, there's going to be more stuff like this, Fire Emblem Three Houses, and just Shining Force, Final Fantasy Tactics. There's a whole bunch. I'm doing a lot of them. The Disguise series would also fall into this. So if you like this kind of stuff, it's, it's amongst my favorites. So definitely check it out. Stick around the channel, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.